Hey, my name is Brent here on Cloudy the Chance of Meeples. Like my new shades? Yeah, fashion statement. Not quite. Anyways, today on the channel, we're checking out something a little bit different. We're not, not checking out a board game per se. We're actually checking out a deck of cards. Actually, two different decks of cards. The Red Fox playing cards. They use these cool glasses to, uh, well, let me show you. You got a normal deck of cards, right? Shuffle them up. This is a magic trick. I'll take the top one. Look at that, the queen of diamonds. How do I do that? Let me show you. Cue the thunder. So the radar overview for the Red Fox playing cards looks something like this. They are standard decks of cards. They look absolutely great. The artwork on these, you can't really tell how good it is. It's just so good. You know, of course, they're uh, Red Fox upside down and right side up and stuff. And then just, like I said, normal deck of playing cards. But it's got some pretty cool things. As you saw, you got these, uh, you get these three red filter glasses and then they got some little Easter eggs. Look at that. Here we go. Let's get that red fox. Red fox. There you go. Just a whole bunch of cool. Oh, there's Kelly himself, the, the designer. Kelly cards. So yeah, just really, really cool. I'll show you how, how it works if you're looking at these cards. Of course, if you're wearing those, these glasses, you just look in the corner. It tells you that this one right there is the 10 of clubs. This one is the seven of diamonds. Here's another one. 10 of spades. So yes, this is the uh, 1.0. The enchant, or it's not, it's not, it's like an enchanted fairy tale, kind of whimsical fairy pixie one. And then 2.0 has the um, underwater theme. You can decide which one you like better. Both artwork and, and both of them are amazing. And uh, yeah, so let's see what this one is. This would be the Seven of Diamonds. I believe it, yeah, it's on both corners. Seven of seven of diamonds. There you be. This is the uh, queen of clubs. Where's this one? This is nothing. That's because oh, it's a joker. So where's this? The jack of spades. Look at that. It's just like piratey feel to it. And the jack's got the parrot and treasure chest in the middle. I don't know if there's any Easter eggs on this one. There's a bunch throughout, but there's that. And I know even the, yeah, the court deck is sweet. I think this is the Chris Ramsey. He's a magician of some sort who makes like puzzle boxes and stuff like that. This is, uh, I believe, Richard Bellers. Oh, yeah, RB right there in the middle. RB, he was on Penn and Teller Fool Us. So nods to uh, different magicians. Oh, here's another 10 of, uh, or another, sorry, King of Diamonds. I bet uh, the Ten of Hearts, you can use that probably for a trick and very cool. So yes, this is the Red Fox playing card. Oh, here, check out the uh, one of the other Jokers. Artwork, just simply fantastic. So that is the Red Fox playing cards. So the final forecast for the Red Fox playing cards as you saw on the radar overview, they are decks of cards. That's about it. But the artwork in these cards is all hand-drawn and it just looks absolutely amazing. I know I mentioned that in uh, the radar overview, but they're hand-drawn. Countless hours have been put into these. I've spoken with both Kelly and Ricky, the husband and wife, uh, duo, duo behind the Red Fox playing card company. And just countless hours have been poured into drawing and coloring and redrawing and recoloring and and all the work so this is more than just a deck of cards it is uh, a lot of blood sweat and tears has been put into these cards and it, it has paid off they're they're manufactured by the same company that does the bicycle playing cards so if you have any bicycle playing cards at home these cards um, are, are from the same company. So they are uh, the highest standard. They're linen finished. Um, they're just absolutely fantastic. And I know that I spoke with Kelly 
and he said that they're working on 3.0. As you see some of these pictures on the screen um, of the 3.0, I believe they're calling it the Enchanted Deck, and it's gonna have kind of a, a puzzle aspect to it. And the cards will link to each other with puzzles and kind of like an escape room type thing. I don't know exactly how it's gonna work, but they're continuing to work on it. So if you want more information, check them out, redfoxplayingcards.com. If you wanna know how to do magic tricks, don't learn from me. Um, I know my buddy Brian Drake, uh, this is hat, dual reality. He does some magic tricks. Kelly from Red Fox Playing Cards also does magic. And I believe on their website, you will also be able to sign up for a tutorial to learn how to do a magic trick or two. So if you want, have ever wanted to learn how to do a magic trick, check out redfoxplayingcards.com. Overall, check them out. If you're needing some cards to play cribbage or hearts, or I play big boss, little boss, or whatever you want to call it. I played that lots growing up. Check them out. They're sweet. My name is Brent. Check us out on Facebook. Cloudy with a chance of meeples. Till next time, grab your umbrella. The forecast is cloudy with a chance of meeples. Mm -hmm.